the world's wealthiest lady L'Oreal beneficiary Liliane Bettencourt passed on Wednesday matured 94. Her domain's total assets is teamed at $44.7 billion by Forbes. Expanded by $1 billion, as news of her passing sent L'Oreal shares taking off, having their greatest pickup in seven years. Forbes reports. Friday's stock pickup, which added $963 million to the estimation of betting courts offers, seems to have been activated by hypothesis over L'Oreal's future. A few experts have recommended that Nestle, which as of now possesses 23% of the organization's stock, may expand its stake. Settle has been banned from raising its proprietorship enthusiasm until a half-year after betting court's passing. Speculators have been bullish on L'Oreal for quite a while. The organization's offer cost has risen 88% over the most recent five years and hit a record high this past June. Preceding her demise, Bettencourt and her beneficiaries claimed 33% of the business. L'Oreal was established in 1907 by Bettencourt's dad, Eugene Schuler. She was his sole beneficiary. The business developed massively finished her lifetime. It now produces yearly income of around $28.5 million. L'Oreal's arrangement of corrective and excellence brands incorporates Lancome, Ralph Lauren, Giorgio Armani, Maybelline, Redken, and Essie. Broadly exposure timid, Betancourt was pushed into the spotlight in her later years by progression of fights in court. In 2011 a court found that her sickly mental state, caused by dementia, influenced her to unfit to direct her own particular issues. She was set under the guardianship of her little girl and grandchildren and was supplanted on L'Oreal's board by grandson Jean Victor Myers the next year. At that point, in 2015, a court discovered eight individuals liable of cheating Bettencourt out of a great many dollars. Bettencourt is made due by her girl, Francoise, her little girl's better half, Jean-Pierre Myers, and two grandsons, 